As always, thanks for joining us. And now I get a chance to do Chalk Talk. The pass rushers for the Houston Texas defensive team have an arduous task in trying to contain Cam Newton. A lot of times you hear the NFL experts and analysts talking about not breaking containment, and I'm going to give you an illustration of what that means. When you're going against a quarterback like Cam Newton, you want to make sure that you get pressure on him, but you don't allow him to break containment, and this is what that means. When you have your outside rusher rushing, he needs to make sure he stays wide and keeps Cam Newton in the pocket and on both sides of that. You want to keep him bottled up and have him throw you the ball and not beat you with his legs. Unfortunately, a guy like Cam Newton, he could beat you two ways. But when you hear guys breaking containment, this is typically what happens. The defensive end tries an inside move, gets washed down by the offensive tackle, and it allows the quarterback to break containment, run towards the alley, and that does one of two things. It either gives him a chance, more time to throw the ball, or to just run and sets up one-on-one -on -one matchups in the open field with other defenders. And nine times out of 10, Cam Newton's gonna win that battle. So it is very important for these defensive ends, outside linebackers, anybody rushing from the outside to keep Cam Newton contained. It's much easier said than done. If you are gonna try an inside move, you're taught to always come back outside and make sure the quarterback doesn't beat you to the sideline because if he does that, that could be trouble for your defense.